picked this saw up probably three years ago at an auction <clears throat> and hung it up for decorative use. Uh, we're going to bring her back to life. All the teeth are there. I can't speak to its sharpness, but I can vouch for its rustiness. I'm going to do my best to clean that up, get the handles all cleaned up, linseed oil on them, and and then my wife and I are going to give her a shot this weekend see if she'll cut. If it cuts, then I'll look into sharpening her up. While I regale you with this riveting footage of sanding, I'll tell you what you don't see off camera, simply because I was not going to touch my phone with the uh, covered in rust. Uh, mineral spirits helped cut the grime and peel off those layers of rust that the sandpaper had broken loose. Uh, the handles came back to life pretty good with the linseed oil. And I had heard all these warnings about how flammable the cloths would be after the mineral spirits and oil were on them. So, true to form, took them out there outside the shed and hit them with a match. And uh, they were not kidding. Extremely flammable. So my barn is safe tonight and now the yard is no longer on fire. Alright, here's the done for tonight edition. I removed both handles. Hit them with linseed oil, sanded the blade by hand with 220 grit sandpaper, then wiped it with mineral spirits until the cloth came back mostly clear. If this saw cuts this weekend, my wife and I can get it to cut trees, um, then I'll spend more time. Now, the teeth look to be in fairly decent shape. I didn't see any markings. I don't know how old it is, but uh, we'll see.